Shit. That is the best way I can start this video. Honestly. So, I had a terrible sleep last night. It was just... I didn't sleep too well. And as I woke up after like three hours sleep or whatever, and um, I'm reading, uh, you know, my video game news for the day and stuff like that, and I'm, I'm reading, you know, Atlas Bankruptcy, and I'm like, oh man, I'm, I must be tired. I must be like, uh, really tired here, and I kept reading and reading, and I'm like, am I having a bad dream here? So the news is, Atlas Japan has gone bankrupt. They're in the hole by $250 million. This is true. I know. I had to read it a thousand times over to believe it. A few weeks ago, I was reading that they were under investigation for some questionable business acts, uh, you know, fabricating, uh, you know, how much money they were making and stuff like that, and cooking the books, as they call it, where it seems that it finally caught up to them. So uh, it, it's, it's come out that they owe $250 million, obviously the public can't pay that, so they're bankrupt. And right now, they're looking for somebody to buy them or acquire them. I just, you know, so I gotta stop this. I cannot believe Atlas has gone bankrupt. You know what I mean? You, you, I, I just can't believe it. There's such a, I should start by saying, uh, the, I love Atlas as a company. I love the Persona games. These are the guys that made Persona. You know, the Dark Spire, Atrium Odyssey. Uh, so many great games over the years. And so Japan has come to a halt. Uh, Persona 5. Who the fuck knows? Uh, print, you know, Dragon Crown, I believe, is still coming out. So that's the one, you know, maybe one of the last few games we'll get. I, I, don't, I don't know. I'm quite nervous about this, but this is a company that created Catherine for, as well, like, uh, yeah, sorry, I'm just so dismayed by it all, I, I don't know, and you know, my, uh, my thoughts go out to all the employees at Atlas USA right now, you know, I don't know what's gonna happen with Atlas USA, I, you know, <laughs> you know, if, if the, the main company in Japan is gone, so, um, uh, hopefully something can be figured out, but I'm not feeling very hopeful on that fact, so, yeah, basically, Atlas is having their assets, you know, uh, shop to the highest bidder. They're trying to shop their licenses out, I guess. You know, trying to find somebody. Maybe Nintendo might buy them. Maybe Sony might buy them. Hmm. You know, well, we'll have to see. Maybe Microsoft might buy them. <laughs> well, whoever is willing to pay like $250 million can have them, I guess. So, oh man, this is like such a bad day for video gamers. I mean... This is such a bummer. There's a couple of companies that I really like. One of them is Atlas, one of them is Xseed. I love those guys. They are, to, they are to me the working designs of our generation. Right now, presently. And uh, without them, well... Damn. So, uh... Here's my question to you guys. What, what do you think of this news? Like, is it affecting you as much as it's affecting me? I'm, I'm sure it probably is, so... Uh... Very bummed out today. Very bummed out today. A really crappy day. So anyways guys, till next time.